Let's do a thought experiment so that you can discover, for yourself, what's more likely to inspire you to act, a story or a fact. First, a story. Imagine you're the regional VP of sales for Software USA, and after an overnight flight, you're walking over the Waterloo Bridge in London on a sunny April morning. You're on your way to the biggest interview of your life to run your European operations. After investing over a thousand dollars on a new wardrobe for this very important interview, you sidestep a puddle to avoid getting your new shoes wet. Just then, out of the corner of your eye, you see a small girl fall off the bridge into the frigid water below as she cries for help. Without even thinking, you jump in to rescue her. As you emerge from the river, you notice that your suit and shoes are ruined. But that's quickly forgotten when you look down into the frightened girl's eyes and realize that she's just about the same age as your daughter. Now, a fact scenario. The next day, after a successful but wet interview, you're flipping through The Economist magazine in the hotel bar. As you finish your drink, you notice an advertisement for the relief victims of the Indonesian tsunami. For a fraction of the cost of your ruined wardrobe, you're informed how your contribution could save hundreds of people. There are plenty of facts and figures about airlifts of medicine, medical supplies, and water purification tablets. But the facts, they just don't grab you, and you're quickly flooded with way too much information. You disengage, look at your watch, and decide it's time to leave for the airport. So what would more likely inspire you to act? A story? or facts and figures. If you're like most people, you'd most likely act to save the girl because this scenario feels real. Specific things happened to a specific person. The facts and figures, on the other hand, are way too abstract. You can't see them or you can't feel them. So they don't feel like they affect you, either directly or indirectly. That's why charities pull twice the donations when their letters are about one person as opposed to presentation of facts and figures about the many. So the next time you're looking to persuade someone, remember, concrete stories trump abstract facts.